hip hop and prosperity gospel came up at the same time. Bling and bling. And it happened to bling up at the same time of the Clinton era when jobs were good and money was flowing and preachers were talking about prosperity and hip hop was wearing 5,000 different gold necklaces looking like Mr. T and the prosperity gospel was booming. It was it had caught a fire because it's easy to preach prosperity when you got money. It's a hard sell when you're broke. You get a different revelation. We started saying, I am the seed of Abraham. You know, we were getting happy, you know, the promises of God. We started saying, you, know, you have to understand, in my day, we weren't singing that. We were singing, I may not have silver or gold. Come on, somebody. We were saying, long as I got King Jesus, long as I got King Jesus, long as I got King, don't need nobody else. We were broke. And the lyrics of our songs in the church and out the church are also reflective of our time. So it raises this question, does the church affect the culture <laughs> or does the culture affect the church? You'd be surprised how your revelation changes with your circumstances. 